Want to gather information, valuable insights, and data from your clients, customers, or employees? Well, you're in the right place because in this video, we're going to learn how easy it is to create stunning professional online surveys with Paperform. G'day, Alex here from Paperform. Now, creating an online survey can seem daunting. You not only have to come up with the right questions, but once you've got the questions out of the way, you're still left to worry about the design. Luckily, with Paperform, surveys are easy to build and even easier for your respondents to fill out. Let's jump into the process. You can either begin your survey build from scratch or get a head start by using one of our professionally designed survey templates. Our library contains a mammoth list of survey and questionnaire templates, so you're sure to find something that suits you. But for this video, I want to show you just how easy and quickly you can build a professional survey that looks good and matches your brand. So. I'm going to start my build from scratch. Now, before you begin creating questions, you'll need to ask yourself, what do we want to achieve with this survey? Once you know the answer, you'll be able to decide what question types will best suit your needs. It's likely you'll need a combination of both closed and open-ended questions to create a successful survey. And yes, closed-ended questions like a multiple choice are a great way to qualify data, but you want to keep your respondents engaged. So break up the dullness and use a variety of question types, such as a scale question, a slider, a ranking field, rating field, or even a matrix type question. Enough chit chat, let's dive into the build. Now using paperform slash command shortcuts, check out how easy it is to create your first question field. Just click on a blank line in the form editor, type a forward slash, to reveal the slash commands drop down and begin typing a command. Let's create a name question field by typing name. Then press enter to add the highlighted option to your form. How easy. Your first question has been added. Now you can also use slash commands to add other elements like a heading one or heading two to the survey. Just like I'm doing sir. All right, now. For my survey example, I want to create a quick feedback survey for my studio class. So I'm thinking to include a rating question, a scale question, a slider question, and just a simple text field. Again, using slash commands, you can quickly add each field with ease. Of course, adding a question title to each of the question fields when we create them I'll add the rating to easy and quick. Now, to enter a question's configuration, select the gear icon to the right of the question field, and this will open a new window with some controls. For this rating question, I want to ask my respondent to rate their experience. Currently, the maximum rating has been set to five, and the rating icon is a star. You can actually upload a custom icon to be used, but I'm gonna go with the thumbs up icon for now. And I'll just leave that maximum rating as it is. Lovely. Let's move on. Now, for the scale question, I want to ask how likely would you be to recommend this class to a friend? Simple enough. We can see that the current scale system goes from one to 10, which could work if I reword the question title, but I don't want to bore my respondent. So I'm going to change these options. Firstly, starting with the option I would not recommend, then I might recommend, and I am bringing my friend back ASAP. Okay, we have included a rating field, a scale question. How about our slider question? Slider questions are a more interactive and pleasing version of a rating or scale field. Plus it's a bit more fun to answer a question with a wiggle of the mouse or finger. So let's change the value here to 10 and include a short question description by selecting the placeholder text below the question title, just so they know what is expected. Okay. Simple enough survey, but we can take this further. If you're looking for a survey that is powerful on the back end, you are in luck. Our digital suite of tools is perfect for creating branded, beautiful polls and surveys of all kinds. You can even integrate paper form with your favorite apps like Google Sheets to better analyze your data, Slack 
to make sure you don't miss any messages and even automatically add subscribers to MailChimp. Plus over 2000 more connections that improve productivity, manage your data, and of course, automate your workflows. We offer all the design and customization features you might need, as well as conditional logic, advanced calculations, and 24 seven live customer support that is unmatched. With conditional logic, you can make specific questions appear, disappear based on the respondent's answers. This makes for a tailored, personalized experience that saves unnecessary time and effort. Now, at any time, you can preview how your survey will look to your viewers by selecting the eye icon in the top right corner of the form editor. All right, so it's looking quite dull right now. And your goal is to get as many survey responses as you can. So a better looking survey equals more responses, which equals more data, which equals better insights that you can use to improve your business. Back in the form editor, you can add an image to your survey in a flash by again using the slash commands shortcut. You can choose an image from your library, unsplash, or even throw in a GIF. You can edit the image directly from the form editor as well. Okay, time to turn this okay looking survey into something that shines and gets you results. From the theme editor, which is selecting that water drop icon on the top right corner, you can change colors, fonts, and make other style changes in order to better portray your brand, business, or personality. And your control over how your survey looks goes beyond just fonts and colors. To create a survey that is more conversational and engaging, enable guided mode under form behavior. Paper Forms Guider Mode allows you to create forms and surveys that display one question at a time. Most question types will automatically advance to the next page as soon as an answer is typed or selected, so your submitter is kept engaged and at the ready. Now, before I leave you, let's quickly jump into our dashboard and take a look at how the submissions and reporting will appear. Here, we can see the survey I've just created has one submission. I just ran a quick test submission when you weren't watching. And all we need to do is to click on this and you'll be taken to the submissions dashboard. From here, you're able to view each survey submission individually, as well as partial submissions for those on pro and agency plans. You also have the ability to export a submission summary as a PDF file or as a Word file. And you can collectively export all submissions for that particular survey into a CSV file. You can also view paper forms reporting and custom analytics. It is that simple to create a stunning, beautiful and professional survey with paper form. If this video was helpful, make sure to like it and subscribe to the channel for more helpful videos. Well, good luck.